little bit foresty. You produce maybe a hundred pieces a year, more or less. Uh, it's a very small quantity of watches. Can I ask why you feel the need to come to Mexico City to present yourselves? I mean, you would think everyone would know you by now. Well, a hundred pieces is actually a lot of work. Okay. <laughs> so, you know, but um, no, but for us, it's uh, fantastic to be in Mexico at the SIR because here we can really reach out to the Latin American collectors and public and, uh, you know, exchange with them, share a few timepieces. Because, uh, as you mentioned, with only that small number of pieces a year, we don't have a uh, possibility to go into a store and see a whole collection. So we're able to show a few timepieces uh, here in this exhibition and uh, that way for collectors from the region, Latin America, Central America, they're able to come and see firsthand sometimes, uh, you know, they will have only seen in uh, photos and image on the internet perhaps. So for them to discover face to face the detail and to be able to start to enter into the universe of our uh, fine finishing and uh, three-dimensional architecture, it's a perfect opportunity. Excellent. So what, what kind of exceptional pieces have you brought with you here? Well, we have um, today uh, we have the GMT, of course, which is uh, a piece which stands out in terms of uh, redefining the interpretation of a uh, second time zone display. Uh, so that's uh, it's always nice to be able to share that. It brings some uh, uh, surprising, uh, surprising first uh, time discoveries there. Uh, we also have uh, the art piece one, the co-creation uh, in progress, which is uh, still, uh, which is also showcased here, first time in Latin America. Um, and uh, we are, you know, we have a few pieces from our main collection. In Mexico, uh, we are able to exchange with the public and uh, collectors, and we are always surprised by the high level of expertise of the collectors from the Latin America, Central America region. They really know their stuff, you know, and uh, so when they come to, to visit, uh, often we can start to explain, and they already know uh, a lot, uh, and then we can go straight away into more detail, which is fantastic. So for the collector, it's a rare opportunity to see the pieces and to exchange with us. So, you know, it's always a always very great pleasure to be there.